Justin. The Iowa House recently passed a bill that would allow voters to decide whether the state constitution should or should not recognize same-sex marriages. Before they voted, legislators heard a three-minute speech from a University of Iowa student that has since gone viral on YouTube. Uh, good evening, Mr. Chairman. My name is Zach Walls. I'm a sixth-generation Iowan and an engineering student at the University of Iowa, and I was raised by two women. Being a student at the University of Iowa, the topic of same-sex marriage comes up quite frequently in classroom discussions. You know, and the question always comes down to, well, can gays even raise kids? And the question, you know, the conversation gets quiet for a moment, because most people don't really have an answer. And then I raise my hand and say, actually, I was raised by a gay couple, and I'm doing pretty well. I scored in the 99th percentile on the ACT. I'm actually an Eagle Scout. I own and operate my own small business. If I was your son, Mr. Chairman, I believe I'd make you very proud. University of Iowa student Zach Walls speaking before the Iowa House two weeks ago. That video has since appeared on CNN, MSNBC, CBS. It's gotten more than one and a half million hits on YouTube. Zach Walls joins us live this morning via Skype for more on this. Good morning, Zach. Hey, good morning, guys. Were you nervous making that speech? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I don't know if you can tell from the video, but I can certainly tell from my voice. I was uh, shaking pretty bad when I got up there, but uh, about a minute and a half into the speech was when I kind of, you know, finally realized that this was real, I wasn't going to die. Uh, and then that's kind of when I hit my stride. The circulation on it is remarkable. It seems like it's been on virtually every cable news channel multiple times. As I mentioned before, it's gotten more than one and a half million hits on YouTube just in the last couple of weeks. <laughs> Did you have any idea that was going to happen? Oh, not at all. Uh, you know, I was actually driving back to Iowa City from Des Moines. Um, and I just I was listening to the Jimbo Handon show uh, talk about you know developments in Egypt. Uh, you know I thought it was pretty much open and shut. Um, yeah, I didn't spread the link at all online. That just kind of happened of its uh, own volition. You know. Um, Do you know who you know, put it on there? No, uh, that was the Iowa House Democrats who filmed it and then uploaded it onto their YouTube channel and then. Uh, People started talking about it on Facebook and Twitter, and it just kind of took off. So you didn't even know that you were going to be taped when you uh, went there? Well, you know, I mean, I saw the cameras, like, because if, you know, you're just looking forward, the cameras were kind of lining the periphery, but I didn't think that it was going to make it online. All right, so you mentioned being raised by two women. What's your mm -hmm. parents' reaction to the exposure <laughs> that this has gotten? Yeah, uh, you know, it was funny when I, I told Jackie, my non-biological mom, that uh, you know, MSNBC wanted to interview our family on live national television. Her first reaction was, hell no. <laughs> um, but, uh, you, know, you know, I talked to her a little bit more and, you know, she, she uh, you know, got her you know, to do the interview. And, um, you know, I've been really proud of how they handled it. Uh, you know, Terry, uh, actually, he does a professor at the university, so she's used to talking to people, but Jackie and Zebby. Uh, you know, both were a little overwhelmed at first, but they uh, got through it all right. So you've become a spokesperson for this on a larger scale, whether you intended to or not. What kind of reaction are you getting from family and, and friends at the University of Iowa? Yeah, you know, um, that was definitely not my intention uh, by any means. Um, but, you know, the, the reaction's been overwhelmingly positive. Uh, you know, anyone can send anyone a message on Facebook, and I've received nothing but positive uh, messages on Facebook, literally thousands uh, of messages and, um, you know, hundreds of emails. And, you know, it's been really overwhelming. Uh, the stories that have been shared with me about, you know, their people's own experiences have been really, really incredible uh, and really inspiring for me. Uh, Do you plan <laughs> to parlay this about. into a political career? Oh, not at all. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm going to school for engineering. Um, I, I want to build bridges and, and buildings. That's what I want to do with my career, not All right. politics. <laughs> All right, Zach Walls, University of Iowa student. More than a million and a half hits on YouTube just in the last 14 days for your speech before the Iowa House. Thanks for getting up early and joining us this morning. Yeah, not a problem. Thank you, guys. All right. Let's take a live look out now on a Monday morning, Valentine's Day. Skycam, all clear. We'll be right back.